Hello, welcome back to another brand new video. And in today's video, I have recreated Turk Run from Ace Race MCC 23 or 22. I think both. Um, all of the textures as well, like the inventory hotbar, these speed pads, and even the music. Very, very cool. Thank you for all the people who have helped me build this map. And thank you very, very much to the people who have tested it as well. Thank you, and let's get into the video. So, I guess I'll start showing you guys what this map is by pressing the start button. So, I can show you guys all the UIs that are in here. So, if we start... <laughs> two, one, go! So, there's the Ace Race music, but the first thing you might see is a time left right above my hotbar, which is counting down to zero. And once it gets zero, it'll reset the map and teleport all players back to the middle because that's the maximum time they can do. 10 minutes, you have to complete four laps around the map. And the lap counter is up here, so you can see um, all the players who are in your game here and their lap counts there. The scoreboard on the side is recreated from MCC and there's the standings, which there's going to be all the players down and it'll show them how far through the laps and <laughs> map they are. So you can see how fast the people might be. So I'm going to skip through the map and show you the little lap system that I've made that goes into chat. So you guys can see how to check your time and everything. So going to the final bit of the map, you go through this and it tells you your lap <laughs> out of four and your time in minutes for in your chat message. You finish lap 0 0.4, that'll only show for you. And ours will have finished lap will show for everyone. And the title command or like the little thing that says in the middle of your screen will only show for you as well. So very, very cool. Exactly from MCC. So let's get in some footage that I have recorded for you guys to watch versus some other people, not just myself. Here we go. Well, since no one's free right now, um, it's... <laughs> And I had to re-record this multiple times because I've been planning this video out for forever. Um, I'm going to record this by myself because uh, that's also fine. And I guess I'll have more time to explain everything. Okay. I'm going to click a reset, start the match again. And you can see, so it's counting down. And then the starting music starts playing. Three, two, one, go! And there's a 10 minute timer at the bottom lap counter i've already showed you and a standings thing um if i can actually make it so every time you go through a checkpoint the standings point goes up so you'll know how <laughs> if i have friends um you can see how much i'm going up with and each checkpoint will take away items from you like the trident and take it away and it's really cool to see the animated things inside this map kind of work really hard on it <laughs> So, as you saw, my trident got taken away. No. There we go. This is one of my favorite bits. Uh, if I can actually make the jump. Yeah, okay, here we go. No. no. Underwater bit, the ruby really nicely did this. Okay, here we go. Little skip here. Checkpoint 7, really close to end. At the moving doors now. I messed up the timing completely there. And this is the bit that I always get missed. Oh, oh, I did it. This lantern parkour, which gets you a better time. We'll see how my time is this lap and compare it to the others. There we go. Lap 1 out of 4. 1 minute and 56 seconds. Um, you can also see in chat as well, if I zoom in. And you finish lap 1 out of 4, won't show for anyone else, just for you, by the way, if you guys were questioning that. And if you're wondering, the lap counter, it has gone up. It has says lap 1 now, which is exactly what we wanted to be, because we've done 1 out of 4 laps. So, I'm probably not going to show you guys the entire 4 laps, because that is going to take a while. So, let's just quickly speedrun this. Okay, that is 4 out of 4 left and 7 minutes and 7 seconds, that is not that bad. 
I've gotten much worse and much better, but that's an average score. Very nice. So let's quickly skip past where the timer goes up to zero because, you know, we always want to see that. Um, <laughs> so you can see how the timer does go when the timer does run out. Okay, five seconds, four seconds, three seconds, two seconds, and one second. Here we go. Timer is up and it's going to be resetting the map, teleporting me back. After it's done, well, okay. <laughs> resetting everything, my laps, the standing scoreboard, and even my invisibility and everything. So that's everything. Um, and also, it also resets all of the players on the scoreboard. So if someone logs out mid-game or something, you can still reset the map manually or, re or it'll reset automatically, removing all the player offline things. So, you know, that's always cool. Um, there's many things in this map that <laughs> does have... That there is little bugs that but i have mostly fixed them and even if they do happen they usually fix by themselves for some reason you know there's some things that might get bedrock does do weird things um not really my fault i think right surely <laughs> so that's all that i have to showcase you in this video and this is the map that is originally made by a java um remaker that i've completely revamped so the map earlier didn't have this entire start bit here back here um which many builders have helped me and i'll link them i'll link them in the description and i've completely redone basically the entire map um every single bit of the map is a bit different from the original map because i have used a world edit thing for bedrock to move the entire map in multiple direction and also redone it to make it more accurate like this bit maybe and a lot of bits you know very, very cool. Thank you to the Java creator. Very, very cool work. It helped me. It made it much quicker for me to port this map to Bedrock. And hope you enjoy. And to play this map, join my Discord server. And I am not allowed to give a download link for this. But you can always play it in um, Discord server events on my live streams. Thank you very, very much. Um, please like and subscribe. And goodbye.